In this video, we present multiple experiments that prove the efficacy of our framework to generate smarter and efficient interaction for a robot operating in presence of a human. We approach this problem by modeling the interaction as a two-player game. Previous work focused on synthesizing a high-level strategy for the robot that guarantees task completion, assuming human to be adversarial. This is a very conservative assumption and eliminates room for cooperation. In our work, we use the notion of regret to relax this assumption and encourage the robot to seek cooperation to accomplish the given task while also preserving the task completion guarantees. The two experiments we consider are straight line alignment and arch construction as shown in the images. To encourage collaboration, we consider two regions, a robot region where there is no human interaction as shown in blue, and a human region where the, where the human and the robot can reach and manipulate the objects as shown in green. The robot spends more energy per action to operate away from the human and avoid any interaction with the human, while it spends less energy per action to operate near the human. The first experiment we look at is the arch construction example. Here, the robot is tasked with building an arch with any two blocks as a supports and the green block on top. Also, the robot can accomplish this task in either region. Using the previous approach, assuming human to be an adversary, the robot starts to build the arch away from the human as shown in the video. Thus, we can see that the robot ignores the human and hence it's not a good interaction. Using the notion of regret relaxes the adversarial assumption. In this video, we see that a regret minimizing strategy for the robot is to give the human a chance to be cooperative. As the human intervenes adversarially, the strategy is to build an arch away from the human. Thus, the robot executes a cooperation seeking behavior while ensuring task completion. The second experiment we consider is a straight line alignment. The task for the robot in this experiment is to place the pink block at the top location, the blue block in the middle, and the green block at the bottom, as shown in the figure on the right. The robot can achieve this task in either region. Do note that it takes fewer actions to finish the task in the human's region, as long as the human is cooperative. Under the adversarial strategy, similar to the previous experiment, the strategy for the robot is to rearrange the blocks away from the human irrespective of its action. Thus, the robot rearranges the blocks, as we can see, and accom accomplishes the task in its own region. For the same scenario, a regret minimizing strategy for the robot is to consider this possibility that the human is cooperative, thus accomplishing the task in fewer steps. By increasing the energy budget for the robot, under the same strategy, if the human initially intervenes adversarially, a regret minimizing strategy for the robot is to operate away from the human. After the human intervenes again cooperatively, as we can see, the robot gives the human a chance to be collaborative by placing the block near the human. Thus, by using the notion of regret, we generate smarter and human-like behaviors for a robot operating in presence of a human.